All right, Jenny, settle down. You on 10 this morning. Windsor, what's wrong? Hmm? Come on. You girls okay? It's okay, ladies. It's okay. Windsor. It's all right. They are friends, not food. Okay? Girls, he's not going to eat you. I promise. But we're all going to be living together, so I need everybody to get on the same page. Hmm? No, Windsor, you can't play with them, baby. Grand rising. Hello. So, we are here with my girls and Windsor, who is having a really hard time with not being able to play with the chickens. So, so this morning, I am replenishing their water, doo -doo -doo, and their food. And so the food that I have chosen to start them with is based on the backyard chicken course I took at Jire Family Farms in Durham, North Carolina. A uh, big shout out to them, they are amazing. The class was so much fun and it was very informative. And so I decided to customize their starter food and I'm gonna have them on a schedule of varying things week two weeks so every three weeks I'll be rotating them so I will show you what they're eating so I started with the Purina start and grow um, I'm gonna be switching them to a different locally sourced feed but to start I wanted them to have this right now the girls are almost a month or if not a month old, according to uh, the farm, Jerry, that I got them from. So, <coughs> yes, they're eating this. They seem to really like it. That's also what they were having at Jerry. So, but, <coughs> sorry guys. What I added was the Wild Delight Bugs and Berries because they're birds and they seem to really love it like they eat that out of the food and then there's just a bunch of this left over okay and so um i'm familiar with wild delight i actually used to work at a garden store and it's pretty decent in terms of the composition of bird seed um protein crude protein and like net, like bugs and um berries and stuff so i really thought that would be a treat for them and then i have a ton of these raisins and i fucking hate raisins well excuse my language but it's true and so i decided that would be a lovely treat for them and they love that too so for the next two weeks well week and a half i guess because we've already done it for a week and a half yeah um they will be eating this formulation. What do you think, Lindsay? <laughs> okay, so everybody's looks a little cooler now. Was slightly scared and freaking out because everybody looked like they were panting and about to die. So called Jire, not Jire, I was pronouncing it wrong. Family Farms. Emmanuel gave me some amazing advice. So, so like I said, I called uh, Jire. Wait, Jire. I just had it. Damn it. All right. Well, I called Emmanuel, and he gave me some incredible advice because the chickens were a little too hot. 
and I was freaking out and I was really scared and I didn't want them to die so I'm covering the temporary coop condo which is what I'm referring to it as um, a different way so hopefully they will be okay they look better now they seem to be eating and drinking and a little bit more merry so Woo. so Winzy and I hey Winzy oh, I gotta get him some water too where you going babe no Winzy sit Good boy. This is my good boy. You're a handsome boy. Just call me K9 of the morning, baby. Anyway, sorry. <laughs> so yeah, girls look okay. Not so heated, overheated. So yeah, looks like things are getting back to normal. Emmanuel said give it an hour. It didn't even take that long. Look at this. No, no, no. Get down. Hey, down. Good grief. All right, girls, see you later on. Bye. Get down. Jesus, Periwinkle.